And welcome back. This is the moment I think everybody's been waiting for. We're joined by Penny and Linda from Christie Bindle Studios in Traverse City once again to learn a little belly dancing this morning. And as you can hear and see, we're about to break it down right here. So Penny, kind of, what's some basic moves for us? Okay, here? first of all, you want to make sure to protect your back. So you want to stand with your weight in your heels. Weight in okay. the heels. Soft, soften your knees, tuck your pelvis, and lift the chest. So all the pressure's off your back. So we're going to start with a basic figure eight, sure. which starts with just a sway side to side. So this is like rocking a baby. If is you've it? Ever, you know, rock, okay, is, it is it possible to have two left feet? Or I have like two left hips. <laughs> two left maybe. hips, yeah. maybe, Thomas. <laughs> you can be helped. Yeah. I can. Right. <laughs> Go ahead. Pull your belly in. It'll help. Um, I think I might have pulled something. I okay. don't know yet. <laughs> oh yeah, this is going on Facebook later. Yeah. You know that, right? Yeah. Okay, so when you got that side to side sway, uh -huh. go ahead and push this hip forward. Oh. And then back. <laughs> you, you felt it too. You feel the burn already. That's right. Is there like a speed we should be going for? Or um, slow? You know, just go at your own slow. pace. Okay. We don't want to break anything. We don't want to have no, to finish your no, news cast for you. No okay. So, <clears throat> yep, forward and back with the hip. Is this, this right? Is I don't know. Well, it's I don't know. <laughs> I'm right. Did you ever hula hooped as a child? <laughs> I did. I did. Just, but she said figure eights. I'm working figure the figure eight, eight into okay. the hips here. Let's so try we'll a see. circle. Okay. So we're going to um, pretend like you have an ink pen uh -huh. suspended from your navel. Okay. You're going to use that ink pen to draw <laughs> a circle on the floor in front of you. Okay. There you go. Yes. My, I might have a sphere. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> We'll okay, see. it's sort of an oval. You're oval, gonna... we're getting there, we're getting there. It's basic right. shapes, Thomas. Yeah. It's, yes, geometry. Were you good at geometry? Okay, no. well then, how about let's move on. Sure, let's go. We, we drawn right. some stuff here. I just want to shake let's... this, this, this is these called jingles. A, well, good. This is called a Tunisian shimmy. So it's basically like you're drying your backside with a towel and the towel doesn't move. I can do this. Okay, <laughs> perfect. We found something you can do. Yeah. Right, we can, no, you right. stick to this move, Thomas. <laughs> All right, so you want to make sure that the knees are soft and okay. the pelvis is forward, the chest is lifted. Now, I'm wearing high heels, but probably shouldn't wear them when you do that. Probably not, dancing. no. Okay. Okay, yeah. now we're going to do a basic shimmy, sure. which is a vibration. <laughs> and you're going to start with the knees just going back and forth, weight planted in the heel. And then you just like, get faster and faster. I feel like the next day, I would be, my muscles would be sore from this. Um, I'm, all, yeah. I'm already feeling it. Like. <laughs> this is kind of like taking a cardio class and a, um, a muscular class and all in a, one. And a dance class. A dance class. You all get it all. One. You get all of the health benefits of the um, uh, of an aerobics class, but without all the stress on your joints. All right. Well, I feel like we've gotten quite a workout in already this morning. <laughs> So thank you so much for joining us You're this welcome. morning and showing us some sweet moves. Yes. I'm sure that Thomas will take home and, and practice a few. I'm going to keep this for the rest of the day. I am. We'll okay. give you an update tomorrow for sure. Awesome. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining us again. And now let's check in again with meteorologist Joe Charlevoix.